North Central Narcotics Task Force agents execute a search warrant at 109 Sandy Drive in Indianola Thursday morning. A meth bus in LaFleur County last week leading drug agents searching for this man, Tracy Taylor. Narcotics dealer, he did ventures in more than one thing. It's in form of ice instead of the what they call the dirty methamphetamine. The task force strikes out at the Sandy Drive home, moving to a second location on East Gresham, hoping Taylor doesn't flee. Inside apartment D on East Gresham, task force agents hit the jackpot, not only nabbing T Tracy Taylor, but Donald Steed and Stephanie Kadena. People that we were going for actually had the drugs on them, so um, made it a lot easier for us. Back at the Indianola Police Department, task force agents lay out everything seized in Thursday's raids, drugs, money, syringes, scales, ammunition, and guns. She had actually the female suspect had ice, which is this bag, these baggies went in, in her bra on the time of the search warrant. We have people that are still out uh, on drug court probation and they're still committing crime. The male suspect, which we were looking for and found at the same residence, had the bags of ice um, individually wrapped in each pocket. And there was a third suspect male, which had the two bits of ice there. All three now face multiple drug charges. As for the North Central Narcotics Task Force, the investigation is far from over as they continue to put a dent into drug trafficking in the Delta.